Hey there, Chicago Bears fans. It's the host with the most right here. It is the Reister. Once again, this will be a special Chicago Bears video. So sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, and grab something to drink. Or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions, and this lovely subject and of course the link will be down below for sure if anyone wants to read it for themselves and don't worry my viewers i'll discuss my social media comments after this part of the video is over let's get the show on the road probably a lot of you know about this but the newest home for the chicago bears are getting closer and closer they have a permit to tear down the old race track out there. So that is good. It's like a a long process, a slow process. So that's good. They don't want to rush us because if they do, it's going to be like the 2002 Deja Vu. Remember that? What happened? They had the old soldier field and they put the new stuff on it. If you look back at it, it was a horrible idea. They even made a documentary on it not too long ago. If you have not seen the documentary, it's on YouTube. I forget the name of it, but it's very, very unique. I think I made a video on it. Anyway, here's some more information about the new stadium. I'm not joking. I'm not lying. I'll show you the screen in a minute. So, here goes nothing. Let me reverse this device, and then we can break it down together. Okay. You guys can read this. I'm going to go very slow. I guess they're going to tear down a lot of buildings probably. See? Maybe. I'm so confused. I get confused easily, so don't judge the right star. Look how much money on this thing. See? Of course they have tons of money. They're big franchise. Continue. See? I'm assuming they can tear the last step down, you know, before they actually start building, you know. Or maybe this will be here, I don't know. So you guys can read this for yourself. They just put this here. What do you guys think about this, you know? What do you think? Do you agree with this? Disagree with this? For all the Bears fans out there. Or non-Bears fans, you know. Let me know what you think. I think... Um, of course, the, the nice up to date stadium, restaurants, and other activities. Now, um, things are very, very slow process. Of course, I'm, I will discuss this more next time I hear more updates the best I can. Okay, now, ladies and gentlemen, bear fans, what do you prefer a dome that it just stays like a dome and it never opens or like a tractable dome because you know like in september and october very beautiful crispy nights or crispy days and then maybe maybe in november is is like it's still nice and then maybe in december of course it's cold because it's in that in that area you know and of course january is cold and February is super cold out there so what do you do if you guys Hire people. I mean, if the people like McCassie is going to hire people to build a stadium, do you think they're going to hire people to have it closed completely or open and closed? You know, I don't know. I know that's extra cost, but they're big time billionaires. They could make a sacrifice. You know, if they have it open like in September, they could have pyro. Boom, 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 boom. They, of course, they got to open it. But if they have it closed completely, they can't have pyro. So I don't know what they're going to do. I mean, they could have pyro indoors because it's meant for indoors. But if they want to have pyro meant for outdoors, they got to have it um, open like they do for the Arizona Cardinals. Nice stadium. Now, if they're going to have it completely closed, then it means they're going to have AstroTurf. 
they could always water it like they do for the Arizona Cardinals. You know, roll it out somewhere at the new stadium, I'm assuming. You know, the other things are going to be up to the brand new bathrooms, brand new um, jumbo screens, very comfortable seats. Um, they're going to have concerts. If you're a wrestling fan, a WrestleMania, the Final Four, they got everything, whatever you can imagine. And probably he'll be in the new video game in the near future for Madden, maybe. I think it will be. So things are looking up. The question is, will this deal fall through? I don't think so because it's getting closer because they got to have a permit to tear down the old race, horse racing track. And there's a lot of land. Of course, it's not going to be over, done overnight. It's not going to be done in a few years. Probably they're going to take a while because if they do it the next two years, then they got Bears got to pay a major penalty to get out of Soda Field because... They um they rent they don't so once this deal is completely done done, and when they break ground they own that stadium, and then whoever wants to rent from the Bears they gotta pay the Bears like, the wrestling the WWE, or. Or Super Bowl you know the NFL that kind of thing because they they, they rent that building, I mean they own it and then other people, to go rent it from. The Chicago Bears. They're going to have the best VIP section. The best everything. Probably they're going to have like a, a little Hall of Fame area. From all the Bears from back in the day. I'm assuming. Like a little case. You know. So this is going to be very unique. And I don't know if they're going to have. An underground um, parking garage. Maybe it will. Maybe not. I don't know. I have no idea. I'm just guessing. And probably like. A great views. You know. So I uh, hopefully it's gonna be a way design than they did it. They wanna plan on doing like the LA Chargers. Hopefully they they don't copy. I want a different design. I uh, hopefully they don't copy off the Atlanta Falcons Stadium that I'd be copying. I want something different. Very unique. And don't copy off the Minnesota Vikings if you're gonna have a completely dome stadium. And hopefully if you're gonna have a dome dome, hopefully it's it handle handles the weather conditions. You know, the course, the snow, I remember back in 2010 when the Vikings stadium collapsed, the dome, that was very embarrassing. You know, it was not the best roof at the time. So let me know what you think. Are you getting excited? Do you prefer them to stay at Soldier Field? Soldier Field, sorry, I'm, get, I'm getting a little tongue-tied. It's so on a date. I'm sorry. Just put a lot of seats at the new place and people will definitely will go. Of course, it was going to cost money, but people don't care. People want to check out the brand new stadium. Have a good one, and I'll be back. And of course, there'll be concerts there and a lot of major activities. Bye-bye. See you guys next time, and always go Bears. Now, follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. If you want to be part of the Rower Show, that's fine. Danny, peace out, and take care.